Suhishvili Georgian National Ballet in Kyiv. Throughout its history, the Georgian National Ballet has appeared at the Albert Hall, the Coliseum, the Metropolitan Opera and Madison Square Garden, among others. In 1967, La Scala welcomed them. Reportedly, the first and the only time a folklore group was given a chance to perform on its stage. The Georgian National Ballet has 70 dancers and a small orchestra. Alina Tsarenka visited the concert. The Georgian National Ballet was founded by Eliko Suhishvili and Ninora Mishvili in 1945 and was initially named as the Georgian State Dance Company. It was the first professional state dance company in Georgia. After that, many other companies were founded on their example. Georgian dances are divided into solo, pair and group. Each dancer has to subordinate to the requirements of a common plan and its expression in the dance. At the same time, the performers do not lose their individuality since several dancers demand competition between partners in strength, agility, elevation and bold movements. Suhishvili Ballet, that's all my life. The role of female dancers is an interesting one. It has a grace and charm of its own, comparable with classical ballet, where every emotion and feeling has its own traditional movement. They're tender and calm. They do small steps and give the impressions of sleeping. We are very fond of Ukrainian national costume. I personally have a few. I gladly wear Ukrainian shirt. I'll be glad if the Ukrainians will wear Georgian national dress. I've never seen so many public applause. Bravo! The male dancers can also boast a highly original technique, for unlike in any other dancers in the world, they dance on their toes and without the aid of blocks shoes. They are the only men in the world who dance on their toes. These are very difficult elements. Such weren't performed in the Georgian dance yet, but we are Suhishvili. And we will. This is mountain dance. It was danced in the mountains. And it is very difficult, but we do that. Belly is one of the key elements to Georgian dance, and each dancer is encouraged to do through training, as it gives them the flexibility and elegance that the audience perceives and enjoys during the show. The Georgian national belly has been represented by world's many well-known impresarios and companies. The Georgia National Ballet has appeared in the Albert Hall, the Coliseum, the Metropolitan Opera, Madison Square, and dozens of famous venues. In 1976, La Scala welcomed them. It is the first and the only time a folklore group was given a chance to perform there. The curtains was lifted 14 times, a record.